So apparently Walmart sent me a box. Apparently that's not even true. No, I actually got a box from Viewer Bill who happened to have sent this. I guess he sent it via Walmart. Maybe ordered it online and sent all the stuff from Walmart. Needless to say, a Walmart box has arrived and a Walmart box is what I'm gonna open up. Thank you once again to Viewer Bill. If, if you guys would like to send something my way, whether it be drawings, you wanna write me a haku, a poem, if you will, anything, uh, I'll provide the information down below to the viewer's address. Make sure though, when you are sending something, there's my thumb, that you write viewer on it, especially if it's a box, that way I know not to accidentally open it. That being said, I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Uh, I'm gonna cut the tape right on the side here. My apologies to viewer Bill and viewers in general, because I know opening these large boxes on camera, it's quite a little hard. It's a little hard to make out everything that's going on. I need to invest in like a $5,000 backdrop setup where I've got multiple cameras, multiple angles. Who's got time for that? Who's got time, resources? More so resources and time are my two hindrances because I don't have either. Uh, I've got some packing pillows. I don't need those unless somebody wants them. Anybody? Anybody calling dibs? Anybody? No? Okay. It looks like one of those old magic tricks where the guy just keeps pulling out. Okay, there we go. And we got ourselves a bunch of Jurassic World stuff. All right. Uh, he sent, let's have a look at this. This is the battle damaged Herosaurus. Herrerasaurus? How do you pronounce that? H E R R E R A S A U R U S. Herrerasaurus. It's battle damage, whatever it is. I don't think I've ever seen these ones. I don't know, somehow this guy is finding stuff that I have absolutely no idea even exist. I did review the blue. I think that's the one of the only few battle damaged ones that I actually had a look at. There's the Herrera source. He also was very generous enough to send me the Triceratops. Oh, it's my favorite. With, with the battle damage. There it is right there. By the way, all of these work with the, yeah, right up there, the Jurassic World Facts app, which I am slowly trying to fill out, because there are certainly a lot of dinosaurs I have yet to pick up. What is this? This is the Hatch and Play Dinos Velociraptor Blue. I didn't even know such a thing existed. Has a little opening mouth. Thank you very much, Bill, for taking the time and sending this to this reviewer. That was very nice of you. Aw, thank you. Thank you, little blue. Uh, there's the back of it. Velociraptor blue, so it's spring-loaded action. And I don't know what it does when you... Does something. It does something, but there's other little baby dinosaurs as well. One looks like a T-Rex. One looks like other. And one looks like a little Triceratops. Actually, I think the other... Let me look on the back here. The other is unknown. Because they have to put, of course, numbers there. That's no help to us. No help to us whatsoever. That's pretty cool, though. I've not seen this anywhere. He also sent us the Gallimimus. I say he sent us because I'd like to think that we're all collectively one big, giant family. I so happens to be the one that does all the work and the recording and whatnot. But you guys all kind of sit around the fireplace, if you will. And we all watch this stuff, hopefully, together. I don't really watch my own stuff that much, but... You get the idea. So there's Gallimimus, also the battle damage version. Battle damage release. And we also got the Stiggy... What is that? The Stiggy... Stigamaluch Stiggy. Uh, it does actually say Stiggy right there. There's the back of it right there. And that also... Don't have this one, but let's have a look here. Or maybe that is the... Oh, well, maybe that is the one. So there's all, all the three ones that I didn't have before. And of course the Velociraptor Blue. So that's some cool dinosaurs I can review. And we're gonna go ahead and have a look at our little letter. Now I have to come clean about something. The bottom of the box I ended up starting to open, not knowing specifically who it was from. Then it quickly dawned on me, oh, this looks like a box from viewer Bill. I immediately stopped, but in case you might have saw the underside of that box, it yeah, started Started cutting it. Okay, so what do we got here? We've got ourselves a neat looking drawing 
which is part Owen, part Ash, all awesome. Once again, his very, uh, very uh, astute, can we, no, astute's not a really good word. What's a really, I need a thesaurus readily available, like right here, where I can reference other words to a word I want to use. Talented is obviously the go-to I wanted to use, but I wanted to use something a little bit more jazzier than talented because, you know, viewer Bill is certainly, and that's not his, that's not his real name. His driver's license doesn't say, view, uh, maybe it does, I don't know. I don't think it says viewer Bill. I just add viewer in front of it. But there's Owen and Ash. That's pretty, that's a nice looking drawing. Imagine if Owen loses a hand and uses what's around to make a new one. And he has drawn exactly what he had it in what he had it in mind. Oh, somebody needs to go back to sleep. Hey, Spot, yet more ferocious creatures for your park. Do not shut off the fences when it rains. From Bill. I can add that to my stack of drawings that Bill has already included with all these awesome goodies that he always takes the time and sends my way. So humbled I am of you, sir. So very humbled. I'm going to do my best to certainly get through all of this. <laughs> it's, it's becoming harder and harder, but I'm going to try my best to get through everything you've sent my way, Bill. Again, big thank you to you, sir. If you guys would like to send, like I said, anything my way, it doesn't have to necessarily be something you'd like to see reviewed, whether you like to draw a picture like viewer Bill has, or if you'd like to let, send me a letter, anything, anything you want. I'll put the information down below to the viewer's corner. Letters are usually pretty straightforward because I, I don't get a lot of letters from companies. But if you guys are sending like a box so that I didn't open it up like I did before, make sure you just write viewer on the box somewhere. Today we were doing an unboxing from Bill. Bill's still sending stuff my way and I got a whole bunch of cool dinosaur goodies. We're going to try to have a look at those in some upcoming videos. As always, guys, thanks for watching, as you always do. And thank you again, Bill, for taking the time and sending this stuff my way. I'll see you guys next time.